since Josh took so far as well. And Savage Love, Lex, Siren Beat is now number one. M. UK, New Zealand. Uh, uh, yeah, that's all I know. Yeah. It's doing huge numbers on Spotify. Yeah. Then Josh is still in high school. We're just talking, not only is he still in high school, he's doing pretty well. We're just because I'm a boring old fart. I was asking him about NCA level 2 and you <laughs> didn't which is great. Yeah. Welcome, Josh. It's so nice to have you here. Thank you. Thanks for having me. So tell me about, so where did you make, so where did you make the original track? Just at home? Yeah, what? in my bedroom. I made it like in July last year. And then it just started to take off. It just developed a life at the time, didn't it? Yeah. And what was that like watching that happen? Oh, um, shocking and still now, it's shocking, like, just watching it still grow bigger. Like, when you see it, it's like, it doesn't hit until you actually see, like, a visual of it. Like, when you see the numbers go bigger, you're like, oh, damn, but when you actually see people dancing to it in, like, big groups, it makes it hit harder, like, in your head. Oh, for me, it does. And, and also, not everybody dancing to it in a big group, group, they're getting real joy out of it, aren't they? Yeah. It's so catchy. Yeah. And it's underneath, you haven't got an earpiece in. And Jason Derulo, Says I like the sound of this, so he turned it into a tune. Yeah. You know, spend a lot. Oh, no, it's not going to be rude about Jason Derulo because you and he are working with your boys now. Yeah. But uh, so together you've gone to number one in the UK. What's yeah. it like working with them? What's it like speaking to them? Oh, um, it's pretty solid. Like, like it's still shocking to just be a kid from South Auckland and all of a sudden, bang, you're like collaborating with one of the world's biggest artists. And yeah, it's still hitting hard to me. And I like still find it shocking. Yeah. Well, it's big, isn't it? It's really yeah. big. It's yeah, a big. wonderful, wonderful story. It's kind of a Cinderella story. Tell me about the music you listened to growing up. And I want you to tell us, because you would have been listening to the music that your mum was playing, right? Yeah. What was your mum playing when you were little? Oh, growing up, my mum would play a lot of others. Like, a lot of old school stuff and <laughs> all of that. Yeah. Isn't that a good story? Yeah. yeah. And, and so, what were you working on in your room? What, so we, what were you making your music on? I was making it on my laptop. I was, I was using the software called FL Studio. Yeah, and um, I was just making like remixes and that, remixes, sound jams and all that, yeah. And what, what was it about this one that became the basis of Savage Love, Black Siren Beat? What was it that made you think, yeah, I like this, this works? Oh, at the time when I made it, I didn't think it was like too big because I only had a small audience at the time. For, for my YouTube channel, it was just a couple of thousand, and that's all I was oh, making. Oh, oh, hold on a second, you had a couple of dozen? Yeah, like a, like a few thousand at the time. And you were making it for them? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, just make the uh, sounds for the love of sounds, really. Yeah. For the love of sounds? Yeah. And what were people saying to you? Man, this is catchy. Yeah. Oh, when it came out, I wasn't like too big because it reached about 200k up until April when it actually started being big. And yeah, a lot of people liked it already, but it wasn't like as big as it is now. And tell me about the dance. Where did that come from? I came from TikTok. I didn't like, I didn't make it myself. <laughs> yeah. It was, I, I don't know. I don't know who made it originally, but it is what it is. And, you know, it's this is such a great 21st century story, isn't it? A 2020 story. Yeah. Because TikTok played its role. You were able to make the music in your living room. Jason Derulo was able to find. Uh, sorry, in your bedroom at home. Jason yeah. Derulo was able to find out about it. Yeah. You're able to co. You're able to co-pro with him, even though you never left New Zealand. Collab with him. So yeah. then, it's such a good story. Yeah, it is. <laughs> yeah, I think you know who you're gonna tell, like, um, like the future, and that tell people, oh, I did this when I was at this age, but like, yeah, 17. Yeah. What school do you go to? My name is Hi. And how proud are they of you? My principal was like, I saw him the other day, he was like smiling, he was stuff. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's pretty solid seeing him here. Well, it's a, it's a beautiful story. And yeah. I, I love the fact you asserted your copyright. You said, hey, this is my tune. Yeah. And I love the fact that you got credit for it. Mm -hmm. So this wasn't only about creativity, it was about understanding that you had a property that you deserved ownership, you deserved yeah. ownership of. So it's a really strong story across the board, isn't it? Yeah. Because sometimes music gets stolen. Yeah. Yeah. Happens. Yeah. Yeah. So what's your dream? Um, for now it's like just to work with better artists on other beats and that. So, yeah. so you're interested in being a producer? Yeah. Hopefully. Mm. Yeah. The best producers are extraordinary. Yeah. You, you like Dr. James. Yeah. 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 Man, it's exciting. And are you doing the schoolwork? I'm sorry to be boring and ask you that question. Oh, um, not too much. <laughs> <laughs> Good. <I'm> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Your mum's sitting outside, she's so proud. Yeah. The, 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 the beautiful thing I love about the story is everywhere you look, someone is claiming you, so it's just against Samoan you, so you, they're saying, oh, Samoan boy Josh 685. Yeah. We're saying Auckland boy Josh 685. Everyone wants a bit of you, right? Yeah. But I'm still shopping here, like, just thinking of it now. Like, I'm, I'm here sitting with you, just here, having, like, some talk. Yeah. 
This is Phyllis and Amy's going to think it's a, it's a very wonderful story. Yeah. Congratulations. The sky's your limit, young man. Aim high. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, you already are, aren't you? Yeah. Well, well, what a dick thing to say. Am I you already achieved it? Like, where was I last number one in the UK? <laughs> Never. Third New Zealand, the first Pacific artist ever to be number one in the UK. Yeah. Thank you. Four year now, MC, number one in the, in the uh, US, right? It's a big, big, big thing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Thanks, Josh. Thank you. Let's just say, oh, congratulations. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you.